Good morning. Hey, did you ever hear that story about when Henry Ford was called to court? So the story goes that at one point he said something negative about the economy and some politicians and other corporate bigwigs took offense at it. In fact, they didn't share his point of view. And so they brought a libel, a slander case against him. And he's sitting in court and the prosecutor, he wants to make Henry Ford appear to be ignorant so that people will think, hey, he doesn't know what he's talking about. So the prosecutor starts slamming Henry Ford with these questions, question after question designed to make him look foolish. Well, this goes on for a while. And then Henry Ford, he stops and says, wait a minute, what's more important? That I have firsthand expert knowledge of every question you're asking me, or instead up in my office, I've got a board with over 200 buttons. And when I need an expert answer in an area, I just click on a button and within three minutes, someone can come in and give me firsthand expert knowledge on the subject on which I'm seeking. What's more important? Well, that stopped the prosecutor, floored the judge, and the courtroom was silent. Henry Ford was a jack of all trades. And you've probably heard the expression, jack of all trades, master of none. But did you know that people stop there and that's not actually the entire phrase. It really goes, jack of all trades, master of none, but often better than a master of one. Hey, Henry Ford, the reason he was so successful is he had a vision, but he knew he couldn't do the whole thing himself. He surrounded himself with excellent people who were experts in their field. As entrepreneurs, and as business owners and as business leaders and as team leaders, that's the kind of thing that you should do. You can't be an expert in everything, nor should you be. You need to be the leader who knows where you're going, but you need to find experts in each area to help you to achieve it. What is it, team together, everyone achieves more, right? So think about that and don't try to do it yourself because people who are really successful, they know that Teamwork makes the dream work. That's enough cliche today. This is Andy Larson, Charleston's Connector.